This is how you work with multiple catalogs in 2020. So I'm in version 12.4, so I went to my Catalog Manager 12, which is here on my desktop. You might need to find it here under your Start menu, which you would find under Design 12 and then Catalog Manager 12. So those are the two places you might find it. So then we want to go to install our first catalog. And I happen to know that this is under 2020 zip catalogs and to find the most recent one you can click this column here I have date modified and there it is it's a Homecrest catalog click open and then let it do its thing forgot to click start first It sometimes takes a little bit to finish up. There we go. So I say OK. So the first thing you want to do is hit Finish and then go to Rename. Find the catalog that you just installed. In this case, it was HC Cab 12. And I want to give it a new name. So depending on what you're working with, you can only have eight total characters for a ca uh, catalog name. So this is seven, so we can add something to it. So some manufacturer's catalogs end in a letter, in which case I would make this a number one. In this case, it ends in a number, in which uh, so I would make it an A. So this would be HCAB12A. Say OK. And then I go back and do it all over again. Go install HCAB12 because I renamed it, it's not trying to overwrite it. And there we go. So you can, if you only need two, you can stop here and use those two together. But I'm going to go ahead and rename this just for continuity's sake. So let's rename. And you can do this as many times as you need. If you find that you need four copies, you can do A through D. Um, if you only need three, A through C. And the reasons you might do that is if you do some new construction and you have all of the cabinetry for the whole house on one in Win in 2020 kit file, then you can have bathrooms in one, you can have the island in one, and the perimeter, for example. So I'm going to call this B. So I'm just going to leave it at that. So I'm going to close. I'll go over into 2020, see if they're there. Now there's some confusion with 2020. I have live, um, can still do local catalogs with, with 2020 design live. That has not changed. The only thing that you have the ability to do now is, is integrate cloud-based cabinet catalogs. As of right now, the end of February in 2021, uh, there aren't a whole lot. There are, there are some, but, um, there are none that I use on a regular basis. So, but I think that will happen over time. They will keep adding manufacturers to the program. Okay, and then I'll go over here. So I have my, I have my catalogs arranged by manufacturer and I'll show you how to do that in a moment. 
but here's my home crest and there are the two that I just installed HC cab 12a and 12b as you can see I've done this before the previous version I put in um, three three different copies so you can do that as much as you want uh, so the way that I have these listed by manufacturer I find that I have a lot of manufacturer catalogs and I have multiples of each so what I find is uh, by sorting them this way it makes them easier to find and to do that you go to preferences which is either here on your quick start uh, toolbar or your under file preferences catalogs and here it is right here show by manufacturer and I just unchecked it but I want to recheck it and you, there's other information you can show the catalog description and show the catalog version which I'm going to turn on also and then I say okay and that's what that is so I hope this helps I hope everybody has a great day